The correct body position allows you to become more streamlined, improving your efficiency in the water. To help you feel comfortable, it's important to keep your head in a neutral position as you swim. To do this, keep your eyes focused directly beneath you at the bottom of the pool. This will help keep your body in a straight line. Keep your back flat and your body as straight as possible. To help flatten your back, pull your stomach in, visualising pulling your tummy button towards your spine. Your head should face the bottom of the pool, directly beneath you at a 90 degree angle, at all times until you turn to breathe. Fins can be used as a training aid to help keep your hips aligned correctly and prevent them from dropping. A centre snorkel can help you focus on improving your body positioning without having to think about the breathing action of the stroke. Learn how to improve your stroke technique for a faster, more efficient swim. At the front of the stroke, gently place your hand into the water, entering with your fingertips first. Your palm should face the bottom of the pool, with your wrist slightly higher than your fingertips and your elbow higher than your wrist. Continue to keep your elbow high as your arm enters the water and you start to pull down through the stroke. Press down with your forearm and try to hold as much water as possible. This is known as the catch position. As you hold the water with one hand, your other hand recovers out of the water. When pulling, point your fingers directly towards the bottom of the pool and keep your elbow positioned high. You should pull your body past your arm. Try to bring your pull, the phase where your hand is pulling down against the water, underneath your body. Keep your arm and hand beneath your body rather than out to the side as you pull through the stroke. Extend the arm at the back of the stroke, pushing backwards as your hand exits the water. Continue to bend your arm through the stroke, straightening it slightly as it exits the water. As your arm exits the water, bend your elbow, keeping it high towards the ceiling. Lead the recovery with your shoulder to keep your arm relaxed. Then extend your forearm to enter the water at the front of the stroke. Power paddles or finger paddles can be used to help you focus on improving the positioning of your hands as they enter the water. The stronger your legs, the more propulsion you will achieve, increasing the speed at which you're able to swim. Keep your foot relaxed and extend your ankle, allowing it to flex slightly while pointing your toes. With a fairly straight-legged position, bend your knee slightly as your foot moves towards the surface. The up kick. Then, straighten your leg as it moves towards the bottom of the pool while kicking from your hip. The down kick. It should feel like you're working hard on the down kick, where most power is generated, and more relaxed on the up kick. Keeping your toes pointed, accelerate on the down kick to generate more power. Your kick power should come from your hip, not your knee, and your ankle should flex slightly as it returns upwards. A kickboard can be used to isolate the legs, helping to develop leg strength and power. A good breathing technique delivers oxygen to your muscles and helps you to swim more comfortably and efficiently. The more efficient your breathing technique, the less impact it has on your stroke. As your arm begins to recover over the water, turn your head to the side, breathing under your arm as it moves through to the front of the stroke. Try to keep your body straight only moving your head as you turn to breathe. Your body will rotate slightly, but aim to keep it as flat as possible. 
To breathe, turn your head slightly so that your mouth is just out of the water. Your eye line should be level with the side of the pool, not the roof. Reduce the amount you turn your head if necessary. Return your head to face the bottom of the pool as soon as possible after breathing. Always breathe in through your mouth, not your nose. Once you've returned your head to the neutral position, slowly breathe out through your nose or mouth. Exhale slowly and comfortably, breathing out until the next breath in. Try using fins to help support your body and keep it positioned high in the water 